the wide off in here. What do you think about your own performance today? Uh, yeah, I think it's uh, uh, in the end a good performance. Uh, maybe not really the best day of my life, uh, let's say like that. But I think uh, uh, it went more or less like we planned uh, in the past days with uh, with my coach and with the team. So uh, yeah, in the end, I think is uh, uh, it was uh, actually not, nothing crazy, but still a good day. You're saying that it went to plan. Can you take me through your time trial from from the start to the uh, to the finish? But if we were a few words into that. Yeah, the idea was to uh, try to keep uh, a steady pace, as steady as possible, especially because yeah, with a course like this, really flat, with long straight, uh, you really have to be sure to find your rhythm and not to overpace too early because otherwise it's going to be really, really long to reach the finish. So that was basically the strategy to, to really get into the TT, find the, the rhythm that, was, that I was able to hold till, uh, till the end. And yeah, I think... Uh, I think actually I've been able to do it and just the other guys went, uh, were able to go faster. How about in the corners? Do you think you could have gained a few seconds here and there in, in the corners? Well, I think in the end on a course like this uh, it's, it's good to use the corners as a kind of recovery to breathe a little bit and uh, yeah, I, think, I think you're not going to win uh, this TT on the corners. Uh, yeah, so it, it, it's actually, I think it was a good idea not to take any risk and really try to focus on uh, uh, breathing as much as possible before the corner and then go again after it. With the CC said and done, what are you looking ahead to now as your next goals? Uh, now I still have uh, Wednesday with the National to do the mix relay and uh, yeah, we have a, I think we have a strong team and we will try to, to do the best possible for sure and after that uh, I will do Paris-Roubaix uh, supporting uh, Vought and uh, yeah, then the last race will be Gran Piemonte in Italy. So uh, yeah, we see we see how it goes. Thank you.